Un es que pasito un poco Papi, no hay problema, Tom. Papi, un gran problema. Roberto, my son, what happened? Un gran problema. They messed with me. They messed with me for the last time. What is your problem? We'll take him out. Only we need some backup. I lost a few hermanos already out there. Amigo, you drive good. For a woman, right? This is no time for joking. Come on, drive for me again. Amigo, take my boys over there. But they mess with me, they mess with the biggest boy in town. I say no to that man. One day this Oye, will chico, be mine. No it's a it's always something. Oye, man, look at that guy. We've all got to make some sacrifices Cubano, if we're going to get any... We're gonna fight like men. Trust me. But how does that help the people in Vice City from worrying about whether they are going to get robbed? What drives a man to just take? What we need are more after-school sports like choir or drama so people can learn to express themselves properly by singing or pretending to be a tree. Have you ever heard a whale sing? It's a lonely form of beauty and some very ancient wisdom. Helping people to help themselves with drama and choir and flowers and my dad's money. Listen, trust fund, Tommy. Your ideas are pathetic. It's no wonder that mankind has woken up one day to find me in charge, amigo. Mr. Shrub, you got elected on a campaign promising to reduce... How much of this can you take? This is the real deal. So much ah! Now my brother died! Chico, you better say sorry. Sniper on the roof! They fight like girls! Take cover! We need reinforcements from the cafe! Take out that cowardly sniper! Hey, man! Fight like men with huge cojones! I Starving child in Australia. I feel all covered with flies right now. Call us, pledge your money, give 10% of your income. That's all we ask. And for that, you know everyone can be educated on the important things we discuss on VCPR. 10% is a really small amount. I remember when I was volunteering in Central America to make myself appear less shallow. The native peoples would give me 10% of their land for a pair of mirrored sunglasses. And they would run around me saying, chicle, chicle, which is Espanol for pretty woman. It was very spiritual, like waves. Absolutely. But remember, this radio station could disappear. The voice of unprofitable radio could be silenced. One day you wake up, roll over, and she's gone. You go into the kitchen, there's a note sprawled, the sound of a taxi leaving in the distance, a thunderstorm rolls in. It's a metaphor for my haircut or this pledge drive. Yes, the pledge drive. Become a member. Only members or people with radios can listen to this radio station. Now back to pressing issues. Shouldn't we give out the phone number? Like I tell the children at the library I volunteer at, look it up yourself. No, you can't go to the bathroom and stop crying. That's good advice. Now, back to pressing issues. Welcome back to Pressing Issues with me, Maurice Chavez. On our panel, we got the secessionist lunatic, John F. Hickory, liberal rich kid, Callum Crayshaw, and neo-fascist congressman, Alex Shrub. Gentlemen, welcome back. Let's start with you, Mr. Hickory. Why the F? For Florida. I'm a patriot.